live. It's the Gong Show. Ladies and gentlemen, here's a host and star of our show and my favorite nut, Chuck Berry. Let's get right into the old gong show. Here are a couple of guys who say that the thing that excites them the most is jumping off cliffs in the water. Now, it's amazing what a person can accomplish with just a little initiative and a good case of brain damage. All the way from Fresno, California, are the Minutemen. In case you're just a little bit confused, that really wasn't the president who introduced me. <laughs> well, all right, that was Ed Beheeler, otherwise known as Jimmy C. Arter. Okay, and thank you. <laughs> thank you wherever you are for doing our show. All right, now let's meet our celebrities. Welcome first from the hit series, MASH. A very funny man, a fine actor, and a former taxi dancer at the Arthur Murray Chip and Dip Club in Rio de Janeiro, Mr. Jamie Farr. Taxi! Yeah. The Minutemen. Yeah. The Minutemen were on just about 60 seconds too long. I, I tell you, you're definitely musically declined. I gave you a three. <laughs> a three, gentlemen. A three. A musical oh. three. Now, I've often wondered what drives this lady to do the gong show. The day I found out, a Bolivian bassoon player in a 54 Bentley. Here is Miss J.P. Morgan. Yay. The Minutemen. interesting suggestion. Let's welcome back to our panel a gentleman who is the epitome of wholesomeness. Yes, definitely. A man who is so clean cut that his shorts are made out of dental floss. Mr. <laughs> Alan Ludden. <laughs> the Minuteman. I tell you what, I needed that. I really needed what they just did. And I didn't think either one of them should go off without something, so I gave them each one. Oh. Two. <laughs> Two. And that gives you 11. 11, yes. And thank you for being on our show. Really good. Well, you can't all get high scores. That, that was a nice little 11. Now, that, I think, uh, all right. Okay, time to read a little letter. Here's a letter from, here's a letter from one of our friends. I'll pick any letter at random. <laughs> And we get, we get such wonderful mail. It's full of love and, and things like that. This one says, Dear Mr. Your MC on the morning bong show talks too much. He sure has a gift of gab. And when he steps down from the short platform, he walks as if he had to a disgusted viewer. All right. Now, here is an act. Here is an act that brings with it some good news and some bad news. The good news is, they sing and dance. The bad news is, they're going to do it for us now. <laughs> uh, just aren't they cute? They are so cute. Here they are, Yada and Beanie.
Come on out here, little girl. That was nice. <laughs> Aren't you glad it's over with? <laughs> I thought so. J.P. Morgan, what do you oh, think? Of it was Adam fun being? listening and watching. Yeah, See that? I liked it. Thank you. <laughs> you know, it's really good job, Alan Ludden. They're cuter than you are, they, Chuck. Oh, oh, by far. They really are. Thank I God. didn't think anything in the world could be cuter than you. But they, they are. They are. <laughs> they <get a> tell. <laughs> Jamie Farr. Uh, they, they made a pretty picture, and I like the way she raised her cane. I give her a yeah. chance. That gives you a full 30. That's as good as it gets. That's me on the show. Bye, Yad and Beanie. Yad and Beanie. All right, right now we have a group of senior citizens. Well, wait a second, wait a second. There's a whole, there's a whole, there's a lot of action coming out here. Oh, I, these, and they are, ex, they are extremely cute. They are cute. They're very cute. I, we've talked to them. Meanwhile, I'll read you a little letter. I'll read you a little letter. I'll pick anyone from one of our wonderful fans out there in the, in the States. It says, Mr. Chuck Barris, just in case you were considering why all the gong show acts are so anxious to get off stage, it's because no one wants to be seen in public with you. I want to thank you all for your constructive notes. All right, now, we have a group of senior citizens. Are you all ready, gang? Oh, they, they become very picky when they have their little stands aside there. You have your stand ready? All right, all right. By the way, we have the Worst Act of the Week Award this week. Now, right now, we have a group of senior citizens who said when they're, not, <laughs> when they're not playing their music, they like to go out and have a good time, which is usually going downtown and watching a... Here they are. <laughs> Uh, they are so cute. I really, this little one is such a busybody with the clarinet. The ladies and gentlemen, the Royal Tudors Band. an extra chorus in on us. Uh, would you believe it? I can't believe it. Alan, what do you think of the Royal Tutors? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Alan I tell wants you what, to join them. The lady, the lady with a tambourine and a rat just talked me out of it. They almost got it. Though. <laughs> that second chorus did it for me. Yeah. I'll give them a six. A six. <laughs> All right. That's not fair. They're not smiling. Jamie Farr. I give them this score and a case of Geritol. Eight. <laughs> J.P. Morgan. I really liked it. At no time did I recognize the melody. <laughs> <laughs> that's 22 points for you, and that means that's something. That's good. And we'll be back with more Tom Show right after this message. Okay, here comes a guy who dances up a storm. Ladies and gentlemen, Kent Mannings.
going, Kent? That was good. Jamie Farr, Kent Mannings. Oh, I think a little obsi absorbing junior would cure that. <laughs> I gave him an eight. An eight. Good score. J.P. Morgan. He's got a tap on his toe and a... And a, and a oh, forget it. <laughs> Another eight. Alan Ludden. I tell you what he's got. A lot of rhythm. Eight. Another eight. That's 24, Kent. Thank you for doing the show. Tap dancing heaven. Now, welcome a 33-year-old singer from Waco, Texas, who says she likes to work at unusual jobs, one of which is selling lamb's wool sweaters to Ukrainian llama herders. So here, from, all right, here from Peoria, Illinois, oh, oh, mm, ladies and gentlemen, Donna King. If I have to, I can do anything. I am strong. I am invincible. I am woman. I am Good. All right, J.P. Morgan. Oh, boy. No, that, woman. That song should be called I Am... <laughs> Put a nine for that. All right, Alan Ludden. No, she had a nine with me until that last note, and I buy it. She's a woman. She gets all ten of them. All right, ten, Donna. Jamie Farr. Donna, I challenge you. <laughs> a ten. And that's 29 points, Donna King. That's a good score. Thanks for being on the show. We'll be back with all sorts of stuff right after this message. Yeah. And a good or an unusual act. Why not audition for the Cone Show? You can contact our staff by calling area code 213-466-9153. Employees of me in the production company and members of the families are not eligible. Now back to Chuck Ferris and the Gong Show. All right, stepping into the Gong Show spotlight, we have a 24-year-old male nurse whose act needs no introduction. What it needs is a female nurse. <laughs> Here is... You ready, Joe? Well, I guess he's ready. <laughs> Joe is indifferent to that whole thing. Joe Man Castle! <laughs>
Oh, Star is definitely gong. Jamie, why did you do that? I always wanted to gong Farrah Fawcett Major. I see. <laughs> well, Joe, man, what can I tell you? It's been nice having you on the show. Bye-bye. All right. Oh, that was Joe Pan Castle. All right. All right. Next up, I got all these little sprinkles on my hand. Next, next up is... <laughs> Do you catch anything from Sprinkles? Next up is a youngster who's going to sing a song called Love Will Keep Us Together. Or if that doesn't work, try a little We'll Hold Glue. Here is, oh, oh, this girl. Oh, she is a fave. Tiwi is proud to present Diane Nelson. <laughs> So you just got to be strong, so stop Listen, don't you worry about that. Why did you do that to Diane Nelson? Well, Listen, somebody speak stuck. up. They're stuck. They don't even know why they did that. And we'll discuss it. Uh, I have to go to another act. I'll see you later. Come on. Come on. All right, there you go. It's the gum. I told you, Diane, I'd chew the gum. All right. Here comes an incredible act. Uh, Keep them coming. Yes. yes. The masked, unknown, halitocular, athletic foot comic. Oh. Thank you, thank you, hey, thank you. Hey, that's fantastic. Hey, wow, what a crowd. Hey, you people really look like a peachy audience. I say that because someone should go to fuzz. Hey, all right. But I want to tell you, this gong show is really selling a lot of TV sets. I sold mine yesterday. Hey, rim shot. Hey, all right. Look at this panel. Jamie Farr may not be tall, dark, and handsome, but he's handsome in the dark. <laughs> J.P. Morgan, a beautiful girl. In fact, she has lips like pedals. Bicycle pedals! <laughs> oh, Alan Ludden. Hey, all right, what a great guy, Alan Ludden. Hey, just last week he stopped the rape. He changed his mind. <laughs> all right, time now for a joke. Hey, how do you make gold soup? You put in 14 carrots. <laughs> okay. Do an impression. Hey, Chucky, baby. Chucky, you want to help me do an impression? What do you say? We do an impression of a horse, okay? okay. Yeah. All right, I'll be the front end, and you, you just be yourself. Uh, hey, so all right. Too much. Hey, yeah. hey, wait a minute. Hey, I'm a personal friend of the deal. We'll be back with more stuff right after this message. Go.